Here we are again. Who's ready to see box number two? <laughs> hey, 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 we're back again. <laughs> anyway, another box to go through. This one, for some reason, is yellow tabbed. Um, it's a mix. It's yeah. a mix. But this is uh, a box that uh, Mike came up with a nickname for. Uh, we had some uh, uh, stomach rumbling days uh, yeah. about this one. Stomach churning days. But uh, he, he dubbed it the Lazarus box. Uh, yeah, so it's kind of back from the dead. This, this was one of the first times this has happened to me out of submitting probably 50 or 60 orders over the years. Um, the box went out, or my package went out. Uh, didn't show up in my account, and usually it takes a few days. It's con season, they're busy, so I understand. Uh, at two weeks, I still didn't see it show up in my account, and I began to be concerned. Uh, at three weeks, I gave them a phone call, and they said, we have not received it. So it was showing that the post office is being delivered, but it got lost inside of C CGC. So um, they were swamped. Uh, I was talking to a guy, Kevin, uh, in customer support, and he took a week to get back to me. So it was a real nail-biter. Um, as you will probably see, there's some pretty good books in here. It was lost, and then one day he called me back and he said, the book's ready, or the boxes are ready. We found it. Uh, I said, you know, is there any way I can get this thing moved through quicker? This is a economy order, which is right now, I think, around 37 or 40 days. Yeah, 40 um, I wanted these books back at this time. It had been there for already a month at this point, and he goes, yep, we could do it. So they actually turned it around in two days. They blew this order through. So literally, this order was found on the 21st. Uh, just a week ago, and here it is in front of us today. So kudos to CGC for doing the right thing and moving this book back to us, or this box back to us quickly. Um, and as I said, this is an economy order. Um, I just coined another phrase, uh, box of disappointment. After our last it economy will, order, be, this is gonna be a uh, good we thought we had a bunch of good grades, and because of a little bit of damage when I overzealously packed my boxes, or my books in the 50 box. 50 books, yeah. Uh, yeah, 50 books in a box. We had a couple of corner dings, eight of them. And uh, as a result, the grades weren't quite as shiny as I thought yeah, they were going to be. Lesson learned, though. No blazers. But no hopefully, blazers. today, we'll see what we can do. Okay. Let's start off here. So I'd say these books are going to be older than the, uh, the I don't know what order I'm going to do these in. We, we've just filmed another one. Uh, that'll probably be part one, I guess. Um, but these books are quite a bit older. It's all silver and uh, bronze, very early bronze. Um, great cover. Spider-Man 20. First appearance of the Scorpion. Yep. It's just a great, great color. Low grade, I think I gave it a four, four, five, but uh, oh, yeah, four, for, five. Yep. For the value of the book, it's definitely worth grading. It's really nice. I could see that being a little higher. I mean, that top corner mm -hmm. there, the top corner's got some wear on it. Might have slowed it down. But we'll see. Five, five. Yeah. <laughs> That's great. Okay. This may not be a box of disappointment. No. Maybe a box of exhilaration. As long as it's not a box of despair. Ugh, we don't want to go there. No, that was the, the purple box we got that time with four purples in it. Oh. That was sadness. Yes. Especially because they were bought like a year ago at, at cons. Mm. Another classic cover. You all love this one. Number 40. It's a beaut. Mm, my solid 7.0. Yeah, a great color. Look how deep the reds are. As Dr. Von Chilla would say, excellent color strike. Very nicely centered. 7-0, Wow. Okay. Uh, it must be Beer Friday. No, I think there's a uh, box of remorse. remorse is what this box is going to now be called. Well, <laughs> I think because they gave me the express treatment, they had to rush so fast that they, they, they didn't let have the, time. They let the janitor grade these books. <laughs> what do you think it is? Just grade, I don't care. Push it out. And there it went. All right. This is a 4-5. Um, another beauty. I think it's a 9-9 nine, nine now. No, I think it's a 5-0. 4-5, 4-5, 4-5. Damn. My nice. CGC vision. Okay. It's a twofer. Another one. It's a twofer. A little bit nicer. Yeah, I was going to say. I that's... think it's a 5-5. Five, five. I think it's a 6-5. I like your calls. 6-0. Nice. Can I say you to grade these books for me? That is a CGC? nice book. Look at that. How red. I can't tell you how many of these I've seen that are just raggedy and roughed up. That's great. Another one. This is one that I, I kind of been looking for myself. And something we like. This is actually a, a resubmit. It was a CGC 7.0 old case. Yep. So we like to see what happens with these. 
seven five. Great bump and a new case. And a new case. The thing I love about the new cases is they have this the, uh, extra material in between the top. And then the other thing is I like that they put the page quality right underneath yeah. the number. Now. One stop it shop. It used to be buried over there, and the numbers are so much bigger. You can see the number from yep. the distance, and you can see the page quality. Yep. Uh, you're going to show shopping around for these books. Here's a hot book. Another classic. Cooling off a little bit. Yeah. I, they've kind of dried up. You don't see a ton of them. It's, yeah, it's very hard to find that book. I actually had eight books one time I submitted last year. I yeah. found a whole bunch, and now it's, it's, so it's hard to find. So 4 Mike says, I think you'll get at least that. Maybe a 4 or 5. 4 or 5, baby. I like your effect on this. What's up with Robin's face on it? still cracks me up. <laughs> what is he? Is he like hawking one up there? It's just a terrible look. Where's Batman's hand? Yeah. Yeah, they both look like they're getting their prostate exams. <laughs> special prostate issue. <laughs> they get like little chiclet teeth. It's just yeah. this is this one's for you, Anthony. You're on the cover. Oh that's nice. Reaper. Now I had a bunch of these sitting around for a long Nine -oh. time and it's become a hot commodity because the character, but also it's a nice classic Neil Adams cover. I think you're doing better than I know on this. Possibly. It's a hard, hard grade. Nine four. Oh. That's oh. a nice book. I'll take it. And these square bonds, they get really yeah. thick when you get these back. Now. That's the problem with mm -hmm. the, this book. It, it's not quite a square bond. It's a 48-pager, but yeah. uh, the spines usually show, show some bindery tears. and mm -hmm. It's hard to get a high grade. I'm, I'm surprised they gave that a 9.4. Um, 9.0 for this one, too, is what I think. I think that I think this one might be right in there. What is going on? <laughs> I think they mixed the labels up. Oh. There's I, no way. I wish, I wish they lost these books more often. I'm liking the trend. I can see wrinkles right through here. Uh, uh, amazing. Right. I, I just, I don't know what to say. Um, I've been hypnotized. I, 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 will, I, I, will, I will wish that they lose my orders more often and uh, give me the Look express them. shipping and then to come back. To get the grades. janitor grades. I'll, I'll take these. Uh, this one could be a, a 1.0 for all I care at this point after those last two. Another 9.0. I thought all three were the same. This one looks 9.2-ish. 8 <laughs> Wow, okay. Wop, wop, wop. So there's one one book so far, um, but that 9.6 makes up for it. This, there must be hidden damage that we didn't well, see. Well, I don't think hidden as much as probably a small tear or something. Oh, you know what it probably is? Um, there was a stain on the inside of the cover. CGC destroys for water damage. It's one point from what I thought it was, so I'll take it. Well, uh, the 9.6. That, that sweet, sweet 9.6. This is a cool book. Okay. I love the Neil Adams books with the moon in the background. I just think they're cool. So this is the one classic cover that you mentioned in a previous video. Yeah. Uh, First League of Assassins. Nice, Here they come. Nice they're cover. coming to get them. Nice sharp looking, I'm thinking 9.0. Yeah, and this is another tough book because of the dark, you know, the dark colors in it. Yeah. It's great. It's a really, really nice book. Let's see. Was he right? Eight five. No, I wasn't. You were close, so this is All a nice right. book. It wasn't like you lost a grade. Okay, so if at first I don't succeed, I'm going to try again. Uh, this one has a small little crease right at the top edge. Yep. Oh, yeah. Um, I still think it looks as nice as that previous book. I thought I, it was it's a little brighter. A yeah. I think it's a little brighter. This one looks to be a 9 0 for me, pretty flawless. 9 2. Okay. Nice. They average out the average 9. Average out the 9. <laughs> And that's how we your, play the game. Yeah, your, your GPA is still good. Okay. <laughs> this, this might be our first on air, me purchasing a As book. As Patrick sighs <laughs> heavily. <sighs> Very hard to find He this calls book. this a 3.5, anyway. and I can tell you, holding in my hand, it's the prettiest 3.5 I've ever seen. Very hard to find this book now. I've been looking for a copy for over a year, and it's gotten even hotter, so I'll take what I can find. Survey says... 3.5. I called it a 3.5? Yeah. Yep, 3.5. So it's got a lot of spine wear. You still want it? I do. $2. You got two bucks? I do. Right. Pay up. Price she's, is going up pretty. to 500 after this video is oh, by, the, by the end of this, yeah, somebody's cashing their Bitcoin money. And <laughs> they're going to buy it. Swoop ding, number one. Really badly manufactured book. Um, this was a CGC... 9 oh, I think. Um, the case was, was cracked on this one. Yep. I decided to bite the bullet and resubmit it. And I think it's, this could this could be a 9 2. Give it a special treatment. 9 2. 
go. And we get into some of the mule books. It's a mighty stack of, of plastic here. So tell them about this one. Uh, this is one that I bought from two brothers uh, from Pennsylvania. Uh, it was their first comic show, and uh, Mike and I, I think, were probably two of the first guys that walked up to them. Yeah. And um, there were some kind of, I guess you call them sharks in the crowd. Mm -hmm. and we were warning these guys about them a yeah. little bit, and uh, we bought a lot of stuff from them that day. I bought this. I bought this Iron Man number one. Uh, Fantastic Four, 18. 18. That came back about a month or so. Yeah, the, yeah. Nice it's already that been one. sold. Um, <laughs> you bought a stack of stuff, and then yeah, yeah. I, 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 I got Spider-Man thirty one. Yeah, yeah. I got that eight five with a little jelly steam in the yeah. front. So, and you know, we talked to them about other books that they had left at home that you know they didn't mm -hmm. think anyone would want, and we both were like, if you brought those, we would have bought them. Yeah, it's worth <laughs> so going to that show. I again. haven't seen them, so maybe no, they'll be at it no. again this year. Yeah, we'll, we'll check see. It out again. But it was cool. It was two brothers, and they kind of pulled their collections together uh, growing up. And uh, this Iron Man I, I grabbed, uh, I, I got a good price on it. Mike's saying, what do you think that is? Uh, 6.0. That's a zero with a slash through it. It does look very nice. There's a number of caprices and flaws. Yeah. I know you're hopeful like for a 7, but... I think it's 6.5. I think so. I'm happy with it because okay. that's what I figured it was. Yeah. It's no worse. You got a great price on yeah, it too. I did. I got a great price. It's a beautiful book. It presents if you look quick like an 8 but then when you look it over, you can you yeah. can tell. Yeah. Still a great book. It'll be up soon. <laughs> <laughs> As in now. Uh, Who's this guy? I've never heard of this character. Mike got into the never, fever. Never amount he, to he's anything. He's got the fever. New Mutant 98. How many times are you going to hear this at a show? What's that? You got a new mutant ninety eight. Yeah, new mutant ninety eight. Uh, I do now. Spider Man three hundred. Hulk one eighty one. Best part, it's for sale. It, it was is. a CBCS nine point six. Let's see. Um, I liberated it. There's a there's a bunch of guys out there that like them better. Nine eight. Look at that. Good for you. It went up by about ten bucks from yep. nine six to a nine eight. <laughs> yeah, that's a great book. This is this is one of the few uh, coppers that I think you could hold. Uh, mm, I think yeah. long term. This 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 could uh, continue to climb. It's not going to be, you know, as fast as uh, like a Hulk 181 or something like that. But it's still a, a book that you could hold long term and yeah. make, make good money on. Yeah. So this is a Lake Effect book. They're still coming in. I've got probably about 30 more of these to process. This one's real nice. Um, first true appearance of Wolverine. Yes. We just talked about this last night on the Wednesday night chat. I concur. It isn't just a face on a monitor. Like dark side, yeah, uh, or a person in a window, yeah, a person in a window, like or or uh, one that wasn't even him, but was a robot, or yeah. or Ultron with the the crimson hood on. This is Wolverine jumping out full yeah. bodied with his claws exposed. That's the mm -hmm. first appearance. It'll never yeah. happen, of course, because there's too much money now in 181 for yeah. anyone to ever consider that. But um, great nice looking. Book. I'm, I'm thinking 6.5. I think better. I like think the way you think. I think you're getting a seven oh. Six five. Wishful thinking doesn't always come through. I know it doesn't. You can wish all you want. It ain't gonna happen. It's pretty, pretty six five. I'll tell you that. Buy the book. Sell the grade. Yep. This is an interesting one. Um. So can you read the little notes up at the top? The appearance. So I found this book. It was a fantastic price. I like the cover. It's I the can't second read it. second appearance of Odin. Journey into Mystery 86. So I if I can't get the first appearance, Zarko. yeah, I'll get the second appearance. But just a nice, solid book. Um, it is. I think I called it a 4.5. Uh, I got a great price on this book, and I'm like, yeah, you know, I'll grade it. It puts sense very well. What this the heck? This is uh, Vince Coletta, I think, inking. Quite possibly. Not my favorite. I think I like <laughs> Mike Royer the best on yeah. Kirby. Yeah. yeah. So 4.5, and it's a 4.5. Great. It's not a cover you see a lot. Nice yeah, I had never seen that copy yeah. really before, so I, I you know, and this it. is for people that, that you know, as far as uh, collecting uh, lower to mid grades. I, I think the thought out there is four fives are junk. And mm -hmm. look, look at, would you call that junk? It's got a big crease in the upper right corner, but very I, sharp. It's a sharp book. The back is nice. Mm -hmm. Uh, and, you know, I, my my collecting has shifted. I mean, I've really, yeah. I'm happy with six O's. It's the it's, it's you know the fourth. Thor, 86. Yeah. I mean, that's an early, early issue. Yeah, and take a four, I take a four or five all day. And this is a cool cover. What a classic ad. Dead man. Nice looking mid-grade. I'm thinking around a 5.5. Yeah. 
folks. I heard the judge in this era, I think. Nice. Six oh. That's great. Than I thought. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And the way Adams draws him with the flesh around his face is great. Another book. But uh, the best part of this, what's in the back cover? Best part is you got the juice dispensing <laughs> advice to young impressionable boys. Um, oh, that's great. <laughs> Priceless. Yeah. You start looking for like if uh, Bill Cosby did the backs of anything. Oh, There's got to be some jello yeah. ads somewhere, right? Yeah, there probably is. Uh, I think this is a 9.6, really sharp cover. It is real nice. Um, could go either way, though. It's hard to tell. Oh, oh my God. That's, that's a great one. That two point difference is all the world in this book. If you it is. The, the, if you're the, buying this book. You know, in selling books, if you look at the difference between a 9.6 and a 9.8, yeah. the price jump is nuts. On key books, On key absolutely. Books. Yeah. You know, pretty much be a, doubles. Be a, yeah, yeah. It can double. I know on 300, uh, Amazing Spider-Man 300, you go from a 9.6 to a 9.8. It's, yeah. it's like $1,000. Um, Lake Effect book. I Actually, for this Lake Effect collection, I bought a lot of the single-digit issues. I have, I think... It's Professor um, X's coolest uh, wheelchair. Yeah. I have a lot of X-Men below number 10 from this collection. This is number 9. Uh, and I really sell it nice 5, 5. 5, just a hair below uh, 6. Um, it is the pinup of Marvel Girl. Mm -hmm. So if you want to take that out and hang it on your there you go. Nice, sexy, curvy thing. Okay. <laughs> no one draws five, women like curvy. No one does. It's 5-5. Five, 5-0. Five. Five, oh. oh, that's the second one that was just a half a grade lower. Still. Okay. Yeah. But single it's a digit, effect. Yeah, single digit action. We did very good on the lake effect. Right. I'm not going to complain about that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Cleaned and up and on we that. survived. So that yeah, we didn't die. <laughs> we didn't it was die. good when you don't not die by comics. It was great. Um, what's a collection, a submission without a X-Men 101? <laughs> This one's real nice. I'm um, glad we didn't have a shootout because this this is this would have butchered me. Gut shot. At, at least at least at eight eight oh, I think maybe mm -hmm. possibly a nine oh. Yeah. I think it was an eight five. Eight five. I think you're close. Eight five, eight five, eight five. Oh! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Greater's notes on that one. There's something that wasn't really obvious on that. Maybe Looks moisture. beautiful. It does. Maybe moisture? It's a great submission. Now, this is the kind of book that an, mm. uh, an uh, unscrupulous dealer yeah. would crack out and put up on his wall yep. and let people think that it's an 8-0 or a 9-0. Yeah. Uh, so if you ever come across a dealer, he's got lots of slabbed books, and then he's got a couple in, in her, He's That's what he's done. He's cracked them because they didn't come back like he thought. So Anyway, okay. look, at, look at the greater notes on that one. This, um, this is one Mike did for a friend of his. And, uh, so I know there's restoration when I bought or picked the book up. It's got a reattached piece on the back. So purple label, no surprise, early detective number 72. Um, I'm thinking this is a 4-5. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't for that uh, detached in the back. Yeah. It's got a little bit of sun shadow on the, on yeah. the corner or yeah. on the edge. Uh, it's a nice book, though. It's not You don't see these that often. <clears throat> Five five, you'll be happy. You'll be you very a one happy. Point grade bump. Yep. There you go, Frank. And it's safe. And it's safe. That piece won't fall off and get lost. Right. That was his concern of losing that little piece. Yep. Or the cover coming off and getting torn or something awful. That's always the problem. I'm gonna cover's put that flying over. off of your comics. Yes, it is. Okay, so this is your copy. Okay. Um, I'm gonna put this right on the back corner. So it's time for a shootout. shootout. So we have a pair of classic books. Mine's from the lake effect. Mine's from the internet. No. <laughs> oh, you ready? Um, I think mine's a six. I got the slight draw advantage. I got a five five. I thought yours was a five five, so we're we're I that got close. some damage but in the corner. As history has shown us, you somehow always pull out in the clutch. Yeah, but I don't have like a date stamp or anything unique. It'll either. come down to the page quality, <laughs> as it always does. This is a five five. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna get any higher. Six zero oh, six zero. Oh. On your mark, get set, draw. Six five. <laughs> So you got your 5-5, five, five. Yep. I got a half point, gut shot, round goes to me. Still, it's a great book. Yeah. Page quality, I got off-white to white. Is yours all for same a change? Page. The mm -hmm. same page quality. Yep. Nice looking copy. It yeah, is. this copy. Nice. Kind of a... Good colors. Corner crease. It's, you know, I've seen this book a lot lately. Uh, Higher grades, and I think what it is is people have had it up under wall of fluorescent lighting, <laughs> and, and it's you yeah, know they, oh, it's never been in the sun, but it's been under fluorescent lights for 20 years, and the colors are faded, so 
the grade might be 7080, mm -hmm. but the book looks like a 4.5. Yeah. You know, yeah, at one place up in Syracuse we went to had that issue. Wow. And we yeah. talked to the guy about it. He's like, well, it's just fluorescent light. It's not going to hurt. There's no windows in this place. There was like, smoke coming off of those books. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So that's that. So one more coming up. Yeah, it's um, a big boy. It's a big box. Yeah. I think you better take some time to go get your brown pants and yeah, put yes. them on. <laughs> right. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>